In a parallel dimension, there is a paradise, a sacred land called Nusai, the homeland of Krusha. Krusha is an enthusiastic adventurer who loves riding his favorite horse, Lasko, as they explore new places together, gaining knowledge and wisdom through different experiences. Krusha is the only child of a much-loved and wise seer. A seer is a person who can see things before they happen, through dreams or flashes of pictures in the seer's mind. The people of Nusai finds the seer's talent a treasurable and unique gift, because not only does the universe vividly share information with the seer, he's also given solutions on how to best handle a future event. On Krusha's 17th birthday, he has plans to take a walk in his favorite forest, Krusha's father insists that his three best friends must go along with him. Unknown to Krusha, Krusha's father is aware that his son would begin his destiny as a multiple dimensional time traveler on this day. Krusha's three best friends are Patch, Sparks, and Silver. Patch is an honorable chief of his tribe. He is athletic, intelligent, and creative. But most significantly, Patch is an honest and courageous leader. Krusha relies on Patch's wisdom and loyalty. Sparks is an energetic, mentally and physically Tai Chi master. His extraordinary power allows him to move energy around in both the body and environment when he focuses his mind. Sparks' dynamic capabilities inspire Krusha. Silver is an ageless monk who is an expert in meditation. Silver is skillfully quick at quieting and centering his mind on creating new ideas and concepts. Krusha depends on Silver's incredible sense of directions. He knows which path to take. Before Krusha left the house on his birthday, his father said to him, Krusha, I have taught you how to use your intuition, so make sure that you use it to see, hear, and more than anything, feel for guidance. Krusha wondered why his father said this to him, as though he was about to go on a challenging journey. Unlike any other day, on this day, immediately when Krusha, Patch, Sparks, and Silver entered the forest, it was as though they stepped into another world. They walked through misty flower gardens that held vast, twisting, tall ancient trees, waterfalls, and strong, sweet, and fruity-scented high bushes. In the glowing, foggy air, they played and sang. 